morning, 47. Your destination is the Himapan Luxury Hotel Resort on the Chao Phraya River, just outside Bangkok. Your main target is Jordan Cross, the lead singer of The Class, a renowned indie rock outfit recording their highly anticipated sophomore album. But this millennial poster boy harbors a dark secret. One year ago, promising young actress Hannah Highmore fell to her death from Cross's penthouse loft in Dumbo, New York. According to the police, Miss Highmore's death was a tragic accident, but her parents remain unconvinced. They firmly believe that Cross murdered Hannah and only escaped justice due to the power and influence of his father, billionaire media mogul Thomas Cross. A secondary target, Ken Morgan, corporate fixer and attorney to the Cross family, is also staying at the hotel. Cunning and unscrupulous, Morgan was a key agent in the cover-up of Hannah Highmore's murder and Jordan Cross's subsequent acquittal. The Highmores understandably want retribution, and while the system may be powerless, ICA is anything but. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Bangkok, 47. Ken Morgan has booked the Queen Suite, but has yet to check in. You will find him in and around the restaurant. Oddly enough, Jordan Cross seems completely unaware of his presence. Cross and the class have set up a recording studio in the Emperor's Suite on the third floor. Private security around Cross and his entourage is highly capable. Still, I'm sure you can find your way into his inner circle. After all, today is Jordan Cross's 27th birthday. The age when rock stars die. Good luck, 47. guy to you anyway. What do you think happened? It's... Well, I'm not sure. I just... Sometimes I get the sense that there is more to a story than what the eye of it. Like Victor Novikov and Dahlia Margolis. What's the official theory? Russian mob? Crazy stalker? Come on. Too easy. Why, Lauren! Never picked you as a conspiracy nut. I prefer insightful and tenacious. All good journalists are. Wait, now, I recognize you. Obi, a tourist. Ken I have Morgan. to read up on all this. Okay. Yeah, yeah. They call Bring you the brick, right? Me and 
from Keith Stone. McKenzie, U.S. Attorney's Office, South District. Keith? I saw you at the Chelsea Whitmore trial. Your strategy was the brassiest that thing I've ever Ken seen. That is Ken the Brick Morgan, Girl lawyer and alive. corporate fixer. And framed her cheerleading rival, and you got her off on affluenza charges? A stroke of genius, sir. I see. You're, um, not going to give me the speech about how I'm part of the problem? About uh, how you will never embrace the private sector because you're fighting the good fight. And uh, well, justice is more important than money. Shit, no. The U.S. Attorney's Office is just a stepping stone to me. You don't buy a place in the Hamptons on a state salary. Hmm. Uh, Keith, Morgan. Give my office a call. Morgan Yates and Cole. We may have something for you. Thank you, sir. Will do. They had this huge row in the middle of the night. Cross and his manager fighting, huh? Well, bring on the gossip. Oh, all right. I only picked up bits and pieces. Something about Miss Barrett confiscating an audio recording from Cross. He said it was for his own good. That listening to it turned into an obsession. Hannah Heimel's name was spelled. The girlfriend who died? Yeah, but you don't believe all that crap, do you? That Cross killed his girlfriend. Well, my brother. The plot thickens. Apparently, Jordan Cross has been obsessing over a mysterious audio recording featuring the voice of Hannah Highmore. However, his manager, Dexy Barrett, has confiscated the recording for her client's own good. Well, I suggest you get a hold of that recording, 47. Sounds like the perfect bait, and if my hunch is right, a chance to confront Cross with his crimes. You could start by searching Miss Barrett's private quarters, room 404, inside the Emperor's suite. Is an officer. Trust me, domestic Nothing, but you know, why don't you just go and check it out? Well, sir.
Sorry for the inconvenience, sir, but I can't let you through here. Please move on, okay? Thank you. There goes my next ex-husband. because the owner's son decides to pop by. Ah, the owner doesn't give a shit. He's the head of a media empire, probably only owns this place as a tax write-off. Whatever. There's plenty of other places to go. Ah, sure. But I know this won't be streaming their album. So, uh, when is Dex and Barrett coming to pick me up? I don't know, I just carry the heavy stuff, man. I mean, head up to the studio yourself if you want. No, oh, no, I don't want to seem pushy. I'll, I'll wait. She didn't forget. Who's the jittery guy over there? Looks like another one of those rock stars. Uh, that's evil. Sorry, but this access point is restricted. I can't let you through.
Okay, stay put. I'll take a look. You bet. Okay. Hey, you seen Ramon? No? Uh, probably sleeping in a closet somewhere. <laughs> Good to see that we're heavy on the security. Better safe than sorry. Want to get it because you're a security. We need to talk to the boss man about these uniforms again. This polyester sticking to my.
Any uh, potential stalkers out there? Nothing out of the ordinary. Uh, good. I just have a bad feeling that today is not going to be normal, you know? Let me know if anything turns up. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Uh-huh. Stuff is, uh, moving around. I don't like it. Everything clear. Something's not right here. Got a troublemaker or something. I don't think I know you. Hey, yeah, you. Cash, darn it. Can anyone please help me? I need help here. You are. We've got trouble. You copy Central? Hello? Someone's been hurt. It looks really bad. I'm going to see if I can help. Sorry to inform you that this is off limits, even for bodyguards. No, 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 the, the cake looks fantastic, but we're still missing the topper. Could you get one of the Sorry. kitchen staff to bring it up here? Uh, it's just a pair of numbers, insane. right? 27? Yeah, 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 I'm sure you are, but we can't very well do a surprise party without it, now can we? Well, what's a birthday cake without numbers on it? Mm-hmm. Do you know the hotel owner ordered this cake specifically for his son, right? His only son. That's what I thought. Don't take too long.
Hey, back off a bit, would you? some dusty CEO. Oh, I see. Cross Senior pays your wages. You work for him. I never met the man, but yes. Huh? Just wait right here. Be careful now. <sighs> Don't give me this shit right now. the others to see a grown man cry. I am so much in need of some private time. Get out of here right now. Move it. How can I miss you if you won't go away? Huh. Chest out, chin up. Oh, believe me, it's soundproof. The sound booth is soundproof, my friend. Okay? Wait. girl from the reception up here? Oh, come on. Is that, is, was that what last night's Houdini act was about? Why it smelled like pine refresher in here this morning? I will neither confirm nor deny anything. You can think what you want. That is Jordan Cross, revered and reviled in equal measures.
False alarm. Nothing to report. Why? Why are you doing this? like the looks of you. Creep! Balls! Slightly annoyed, we'll admit to that. Not more, though. Keeping it in check. Deep breaths. In through the nose, out through the mouth. Both those great Thomas Claus and an army of ass kicking And now, the moment of truth. Target down. Next up, Ken Morgan. like the old album. What do you say, Wes? Hello, 
Uh, huh? It's the hotel's policy. Keep it exclusive, yet humble. How stuff? Mr. Bodyguard! I never could stand high humidity. Lara. Slow down, Mr. West. I can't... Did you hit something? Is that what you're telling me? Are you drunk? Where is the body? Did you leave it in the street? In the trunk. Oh, Mr. West. What were you thinking? You realize this could ruin your stock exchange listing. All right. We need to move swiftly. The cops work hit and run cases fast and hard. I need you to call my man in upstate New York, Fixer, by the name of Corvo. He will find you a suppliant. Someone who takes the blame, Mr. West, and does the time. It's a career to some. Your car was stolen and some pothead hit a jogger. He panicked and dumped the body in the river. End of story. Guilt is for nostalgics, Mr. West. Make the call. So, what are we really doing here, sir? If you don't mind me asking. Not at all. Snooping is man's defining trait. You see, Otis, the bulk of my work takes place behind the scenes. I'm a fixer, only occasion. Of course, Would you throw yourself on a grenade to save me? You only go if diplomacy fails. You're here on Thomas Cross's behalf, aren't you? That's why you don't want his son to know we're here? Bingo. A young Master Cross is the proverbial thorn in his father's eye. Not to mention a royal screw-up. <sniffs> Tossing his girlfriend off a roof, really. You can't trust a man who's unable to control his emotions. Hmm. It's undignified, sir. Anyway, that is what we're here for. Leverage. My client wants to tighten his son's leash, and Dexy Barrett has just the thing we need. It's called due diligence. I get it. But if Jordan goes down, doesn't everyone who helped him escape justice go down with him? Including you and his dad? Not necessarily. We would claim good faith and let Dexy Barrett take the fall. We have spun worse stories. And bad publicity is good for the ratings. Hmm. Well, I'm glad I'm not a lawyer, sir. I don't think my conscience could take it. <laughs> <laughs> Touché. Hey there, Mr. Bodyguard.
Anyway, did I tell you about myself? You know the young Weird. Feel safe seeing you. That's not true at all. We have a distinguished guest list. Even the Dalai Lama has stayed with me. You know, sometimes. Oh, you know what I found? Uh, I hope it wasn't disgusting. No, it's just stupid. Someone left their wallet in their pockets, and it had at least a couple of thousand pounds. Why don't people check their pockets before sending them to the laundry? Did you keep them? No. I just think it's vulgar. There was at least a month's pay in that wallet. Yeah, I always think it's weird, honey. Aha. Uh -huh. According to the hotel manager's memo, drunken members of Jordan Cross's sound crew broke into the Queen Suite last night and trashed the place. Housekeeping is fast at work, which is why Ken Morgan and his bodyguard are not yet settled in. Sounds promising. According to the manager, a member of staff is supposed to escort Morgan to his suite once the cleaning staff is done. That someone could be you, 47. I know how you love to grovel. have to get there by plane. And they say he's got more surveillance than like the freaking Vatican and a security court of match. But why? I don't know. I guess because he can. And he never leaves. I mean, got it for a long time. Sure you got it all in the front. Hold that fire from a lap. Okay, I hear you. I'll check it out. Okay, thanks. Taking a look, I heard something. Don't know what it was. Uh, yeah, uh, okay. Ah. Okay, I understand your concern. I'll have a look. Okay, I'll hear you. Why, you little. <laughs> I want to get that package away, but reception is one of our guys picked it up an hour ago. 
Mr. Morgan, sir. When can I have my sweet? Please accept my heartfelt apology for the mishap earlier. The Queen Suite is ready for you. Follow me. Well, that was relatively fast. Very well. Lead the way. To me, Providence is where Jordan and I did quite Doing okay? Busy. Good. Clicked, you know? I'm really no, 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 no. No staff through you. here. Only got Sorry. I yesterday morning, so I haven't had a single vote. Eh, I like the earlier stuff. <laughs> How are you not excited about this? Eh, well, you know, I'm Generation X. We're never excited. Just keep smiling. You know it. Make sure there's fresh coffee in the library, please. Have a great day, man. Everything is to your liking. Hmm. A definite improvement. Extra Hardly shampoo in 106. Jamarab. Let's take a closer look. Ah, see there? A smear, as expected. But take care of it, please. So sloppy. Mm-hmm. I think I heard the servant bell. Mm-hmm. 
covered in dust. I dare say this, mm hmm Everything seems to be in order here. Excellently done, Fawcy said. Let's make Morgan Why feel right at home. Surprised? You know what to do. Now, the scene of the crime. Mm. Hey, don't you... Hey! Clean within hours of the kidnapping. Someone will 
to the sun dead to lure out the father. Someone smart enough to stay in the shadows while we did the wet work, and the High Moors picked up the check. A shadow client. Someone got rich. The contract was just. That was a sound problem. I know you don't care about politics, 47. But ICA is neutral, or as has been. Can't allow ourselves to be manipulated. Besides... It's happened before. Italy. Morocco. Paris. All our clients got their intel the same way. Anonymous tips from a hidden source. Each contract perfectly legit, yet part of a grander design. I don't see the pattern. Somebody does. The board has asked us to chase down this shadow client, and our analysts are closing in as we speak. I know that tone. Someone's playing a game, 47. The question is, 